Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, Reading and Retail. If you're new here, I'm Crystal. Welcome. Hope everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving yesterday. We did. Um, tonight's video, I thought I would talk about the books I've been collecting um, over the last two weeks. Now, I always shop on thriftbooks.com because they have used books and they're very reasonable in price. Now, about two weeks ago, they had a buy one, get one free. So I had to go on there and get a lot of the goosebumps that I've planned on buying. That way when spooky season rolls around again, I'm prepared and I love the books. So I hauled all goosebumps except for one. So the one that is not a goosebumps strictly for cover, of course, is the waitress. I love the artwork and I love the fact that the W is the utensils. So this will fit right in with spooky season. Okay, so the first goosebumps. After I got to looking at my collection that I already have right now, I realized I had accidentally ordered a duplicate. So I'm gifting um, one of them to someone. I've already reached out to her and I asked her if she had this and she said no. So I'm gonna mail this one out to her. So this one, this one I remember saying gives me Stephen King It vibes. I love this. A Nightmare on Clown Street. I'm one of those people that love horror. So I read horror all year round, not just in October. Now the next one I picked up, this one is called Say Cheese and Die Again. I think that, I don't know if this is a second to this since it says Say Cheese and Die Again. I'll have to look that up and see if there's a first one. But I love this cover. So when I saw this one, I had to get it. Okay, the next one I picked up is called The Wizard of Ooze. The artwork on this is amazing. This gives me comic book vibes, so I had to get that. Next one I picked up is called The Hunter. I love this. Not only does this have great artwork, a ghost, it also has that spooky house. That drew my attention. But you kinda gotta love them nails too, gotta love it. Okay, this next one I picked up, when I first saw this one, I had to do a double take because I was like, what is this? It's a hamster. This one is called Little Shop of Hamsters. Now, if you're old enough to know Little Shop of Horrors, that's why I got this. I found it so hilarious that this was called Little Shop of Hamsters. It's gonna be very hard for me to choose what I'm gonna read next. because I think I'm gonna go ahead and and incorporate a Goosebumps in with my TBR since I have quite a great collection now. And they're short reads. Like this one is, uh, where's the page number? Uh-oh, hold on a minute. Oh, I think they're introducing a next book. Okay, so this one is only 130 pages. So I could do this in one day, so. Yeah, it's going to be hard for me to figure out which one I want to do next. Okay, this next book I bought just because I hate puppets. <laughs> and I know that sounds crazy, but I do. I don't like puppets. I don't like mannequins. I don't like dolls. But if you put it on a spooky cover of a book, I'm going to buy it. Night of the Puppet People. I love it. I don't think I'd be having one of these puppets in my house. <laughs> I'd be afraid it'd kill me in the night. So yeah, we're not doing puppets. Okay, so this next one is um, Revenge of the Living Dummy. That is too funny. Play on Revenge of the Living Dead. Love that so much. The person that does the artwork, genius. Absolutely genius. Got two more. This next one is called Welcome to the Wicked Wax Museum. That's another thing that kind of creeps me out. Movies about wax museums, because everybody knows 
the wax is gonna come to life and kill you. Everybody knows this. Do not go into a wax museum. There's that one, got one more. This one um, screams Captain Hook, of course. Attack of the Jack. But you see his hook there. Let me zoom in. There you go. I just love it. So yeah, guys, that is my little haul. I could not resist when it was buy one, get one free. I told myself I'm going all out goosebumps. I'm not getting anything else. Yes, this was too fun to do. Okay, guys, if you made it this far, I appreciate you hanging out with me. If you would for me, throw me a like. It helps my channel grow. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you in the next video.